So anyways, I'm not going to show video of anything in particular. I'm going to talk. Um, got a few things that are on my mind that i got to get off my mind. Um, first off, Peter Compagno. What a douchebag, dude. Um, stole my friend's clothes that we got back yesterday. Um, his parents are still fucking gay douchebags. So you know how that all goes down. Um, my friend moved in with him in August and he was kicked out. Um, and you know, clothes were left there and shit like that. And, uh, we're trying to get this shit back last Saturday night. And, yeah, we couldn't get it back. So we met up yesterday and got them back. So I'm kind of happy about that. Um, you know. My friends have been going through a lot of hassle in the last couple weeks. He's my a good job. Um, my buddy DJ. I know. Um, I love him very much. Um, I'm trying to think. Hockey's been very good. Uh, still playing one every Wednesday night. Not great this yet. Back in form. I'm going to start playing ice again here soon, hopefully. It's one of my goals. And, uh, go from there. Um, next couple weeks. My schedule is like this. Tonight, going to a Philadelphia Flyers versus Phantoms game. Tomorrow night, getting to play hockey. Every Wednesday night, hockey. So if you guys are interested, come up to Christian Skating Center. Um, Ten bucks for Fords and zero dollar for goalies. Christian Skating Center. We start around nine o'clock. Go to about eleven thirty, twelve o'clock. It's, uh, it's actually pretty fun. We play about three periods and then go into the fourth period. Um, Trying to think of what else. And then next week, Monday morning around 8 o'clock, we are going to Pittsburgh. And I'm going to see the Philadelphia Flyers play Pittsburgh and Pittsburgh on Tuesday night. Um, B. Ron will be there, I hope. He better be there. I'm going to kill him. No, I'm joking. <laughs> I love B. Ron. Um, and then I'm hoping to get a couple more season tick uh, some tickets for the rest of the year. Um, other than that, I got a story to tell you about PD. PD's my friend. You know, I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna take a shit in a brown bag, light it on fire, put it on his back porch. He's gonna go out there and see it. He's like, I know what I can do. I can put Toto on there. Oh, I forgot he was sleeping for 24 hours. He's really dead. Wink, wink. I know what I can do. I'll put Kimberly on it. Oh, never mind. She's so cute and sexy, and I have sex with her every night, even though she has a big penis. So I can't do that. Or we could... I know. We can call the fire department. I know. Do you know what I know? Because I don't think you know what I know. Anyways, I'm going to go and go. I will keep you updated next week. Um, talk to you later. Oh, one last thing. Red Sox, amazing, amazing game last night. Uh, to take the win 3-2 to two over the Anaheim Angels. I thought they were going to blow it at once again. But, of course, Jason Bay. What what a man. Um, and all these calls that they've had over this last year, it's been amazing. I mean, really don't know what's happening up there anymore. And, you know, I wish I could just move back and just go up there and party every night, you know, up in Boston. I mean, it'd be fun. But, um... I'm going to go ahead and go. Talk to you guys later. Have a good couple weeks. And call my cell phone if you need me. Bye.